Now we come to lesson number 22. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Lesson number 22. Adarful Sani Walishroon. Page number 190, brothers and sisters. As usual, we go straight to the we go straight to the verbs. Huh? We are doing form seven. What is the speciality of form seven, brothers and sisters? That in the beginning, Hamza is coming, and then Noon is coming. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Form seven, eight, nine, and ten. In all these four forms, in the beginning, Hamza will come. But we must understand that this Hamza is Hamzatul Vasal. Huh? It's not Hamzatul Kata. It is important to make a note of it. Huh? So if Waw comes, then that Hamza is not pronounced. Anything comes in front of it, it will not be pronounced. Huh? You will remember that. In Kasara, brothers and sisters, in Kasara, what will be the Mudaria? Yan Kasiru. Yan Kasiru. In this, brothers, starting from form 7, Ain Kalina will always get a Kasara. So if you say in Kasara, brother, break this down. In kasara. So in is extra. Are you with me? Aleph and nun is extra. And where is the fa kalima? Ka. Where is the ain kalima? Sin. Huh? So in other words, when you go to modarya, ain kalima will always get a kasara. You remember that. Huh? In kasara, yan kasiru. Yan kasiru. Fine, brother. And ismu file, mun Kasirun, huh? very easy for us. And and then in Kisarun. So you will always remember Bab in Fialun. Huh? This is called, when you say Bab in Fialun, means Form 7. Try to remember it, brothers and sisters. Now, one more thing, brothers and sisters. Very important thing. Most of the verbs in Form 7 are intransitive. What are they? Uh, they will not have a full be Most of them. And if they are intransitive, then there will be no ism maful. There will be no ism maful. But we will still make it ism maful because ismu zaman and ismu makan is, on the ma- is made on the pattern of ism maful. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? There is no maful bihi. Why? Because most of the verbs in this form are uh, intransitive. Fine, brothers and sisters. In Fataha. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What will be the modarya? Yan Fatihu. Ismu file? Mun Fatihun. Master? In Fitahun. In Fitahun. Okay. In Kalaba. Yan Kalibu. Mun kalibun. And then in kilab. You know that word in kilab. In kata'a. Yan kati'u. Eh? And mun kati'u. And then in. In kita'un. Find the. In sarafa. Yan sarifu. Mun sarif. And in siraf. Brother. In shakka. Now this is something. Uh, to be understood well, brother and sister, in shakka, and it will be yan shakku. Why it is yan shakku, brother? Hmm? Let us do it properly, huh? so that you understand, inshallah. In shakka, break it down, brother and sisters. It is in. In shakaka. 
Are you with me? Now, what is the mudarya? Yang Shak Hu. Make a mudarya from here. How will you make it? Yang Sha Ti Ku. Huh? Are you with me? And we know from our experience with Mudaaf, if the Ain Kalima and Lam Kalima are same, then we make changes. Brother, sister, so what change will that be? Hmm? Hmm? We'll drop this and we'll give it a Sukun. Got the idea? Why we are doing this? Because it is mudaf. Remember mudaf? Give me an example of mudaf. Hajj. Huh? See, hajj. Huh? Huh? Marra. Huh? Huh? So these are all mudaf. Shamma. Okay. So when you cross the kasra and give it a sukun, huh? then there is idgham. And what is that, brother and sisters? Then it became yan shakku. Huh? I hope you understood. Huh? Is it correct, brother Hassan? You understand, inshallah? Okay. And same thing will happen. Make isam file from here. Make isam file from here. Mun sha ki ku. Are you with me? Same thing. Ain Kalima and Lam Kalima are same. So we give a sukun. And we give a idgham. What will happen now, brother and sister? Mun Sha Kun. Do you see how it comes? Huh? Is it clear, brother and sisters? Huh? Remember this. Huh? In shakka. What is the meaning of in shakka, brother? To split. Huh? In kasara, it broke. In fataha, it opened. Huh? In kalaba, it, it overturned. Huh? In kataha, it got cut. In sarafa, Brother, in Sarafa is to depart, to leave. Huh? To leave or to depart. Huh? The meaning of in Sarafa, write down, brother and sister, Zahaba. What is it? Zahaba. Huh? He left. Okay? In Shakka, what is the meaning of in Shakka? To split apart. Huh? To cleave, to crack, that is the meaning of in Shakka. Monshakkun. And when you make the bastar, then of course you have to separate them. In shikakun. In shikakun. Fine, brother. Now comes nakis. In jala. What will be the mudariya, brother and sisters? Yanjali. Which is actually yanjali you. Huh? Chala. And then there's some file. Munjaliyun became Munjalin. We know how to do it. Huh? Okay, it's, it's Mankus. Okay. Now we do the Bastar. Make it from the original letters. Injila Yun. And then that Yun will become On. Huh? Injila Un. Huh? Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That's it. It is a very interesting lesson, brothers and sisters. And uh, now you will try to figure out when we read the lesson, where is uh, Madi, Mudarya, uh, Mastar, Isam file. You will all try to remember. There is other thing that I will inshallah point out to you. 
But when you will read the key, things will become even more easy. Inshallah. Al Mudarris, brothers and sisters. Hatu Dafatira Ya Ikhwanu. Translation Hatu Dafatira Ya Ikhwanu. Bring the Bring the Notebooks. Okay. At Tullabu, the students, Yusallimuna Dafatira. Brother, Yusallimuna Dafatira means they give the notebooks. Okay, brothers and sisters? They hand over the notebooks. Okay. They turn in the notebooks, brother. Al Hassan. Brother Hassan? Ana Lam Aktub. Al Wajibati Ya Ustad. Translation, brother. Wajibat is your homework. I did not write the homework, Ya Ustad. Lima. Remember, we have understood this word before. Why? And ha come? Huh? How sati, silent ha. Lima. What is your answer, Brother Hassan? In kasarat nazarati. My glass is broke down. Huh? Who broke it? No, that's not mentioned. In other words, brothers and sisters, form seven is like majhul. Huh? It, it behaves like majhul, but it is not majhul. Because if it is majhul, then we have a knife file. It does not have knife file. It has a file. Huh? So where is the file? In kasarat nazaratu. Huh? And mudaf mudafili. Fala astatiu an akra an akra au aktuba. Translation, brother? And I cannot. I could not read or write. Read or write. Huh? I could not read or write. Astatiu. What is astatiu? Form 10. What is madi? Istata. Remember, it's a very beautiful, important verb. Is ta. Ta a. Yes, ta ti u. Five in your pocket. Yes, ta ti u, ta sta ti u, ta sta ti u, na sta ti u, asta ti u, na sta ti u. Yes. Yes, ta ti u, ta sta ti u, ta sta ti u, asta ti u, na sta ti u. Fine, brother and sister. Al Mudaris. Udruka Makbulun. Your pretext, your excuse is accepted. <laughs> okay? Okay? Your excuse, accepted, brother. Wa aina daftaruka ya muavia. O muavia, where is your daftar? What is the answer? Ana aidan. Lam Akhtub. I also <laughs> did not write. Huh? What is Buddha saying, brother? An kasarat nazaratuka aidan? Your glass is also uh, broke down? Brother, look at it. An kasara. Why? What is this an kasara? <laughs> ah, mashallah. We have to remember this. Huh? Okay. In this form and in the next form also, brother, in it also, it will be the same thing. In Kasara. Remember, this is Hamzatul? Hamzatul Wasal. If anything comes in the beginning, in front of it, it will not be pronounced. So we are asking the question. What is this? A Harfu Istifam. No, brother, that thing will not be pronounced. It will not be pronounced. So in this case, it is completely dropped. So how will you pronounce now? Ankasara. But you have to also change the tone of your voice. As a, asking a question. You know, we change our tone of the voice. Uh, to ask a question. An kasarat 
nazaratuka huh? ankasarat nazaratuka so actually it is a inkasarat nazaratuka but we drop the hamdatul wasal and say ankasarat nazaratuka did your glasses also your specs also broke down mawia la la my glasses didn't break down brother huh? la in kataat in katatil kahrabau what is kahrabau this is your file electricity hydro the hydro got cut off huh fi mahajaina are you with me brother la in katatil kahrabau fi mahajaina buaid soon after huh salatil maghrib huh are you with me brothers and sisters wa istamarra now what is this brother istamarra form 10 huh huh form 10 to continue huh wa istamarra marra al intika'u ila muntasaf al layl how many things are there in this huh first is in kata'a what is that brother and sister in kata'a this is your mahdi huh? okay and then in kitau that is your master and muntasaf huh? but this is not this is not form 7 uh, huh? this is form 8 huh? but this is this is zarfu zaman what is it brother and sisters ila muntasafil lain so muntasaf is here uh, time brothers and sisters okay did you get the translation you didn't get the translation the hydro got cut off in our dormitory huh? soon after salat al maghrib and it remained it continued cut off till midnight Are you with me till midnight? Yan fatihul babu wa yadkhulu adnan. Translation brother. The door opens. The door opens. The door opens. Babu is the file. And adnan enters. Brothers. Lima taakharta ya adnan. Lima taakharta ya adnan. Why? are you late why did you come late brother in kalabat sayyaratun sayyaratun so what is sayyaratun file in kalabat tautani si ha akar overturned akar overturned okay fit tarik on the way fatawakkafa murur what is murur traffic so the traffic came to stand still udhar is brother ankalabat sayaratun what is it ankalabat say instead of a in ankalabat sayaratun aina where fil munat alladhi ba'd aljisri translation brother what is munat turning point how after sometimes a bridge there is a turning point as you go on highway there is a ramp uh, you turn around okay so that is your munatafa but is it form 7 it is form 7 so what is it ismu makha uh, turning point okay what is jis bridge what is jisr bridge brother al mudarris asalim al rukab for the passengers safe how are they safe naam salimu they escaped ha walhamdulillah Now here is something else we are going to learn something very beautiful brother 
It has come again. Lawla Fadlullahi. Had it not been for the grace of Allah. Lawla Fadlullahi alayhim. Lamatu. So Lam comes for Jawab. Matu. They would have died. Okay. Now we are going to understand this uh, in detail, inshallah. Hmm? Lawla. How to use Lawla. And what happens? We are going to learn in detail later on, brother. In the dars, in this dars only. Kanalin kilabu, kanalin kilabu, master, brother. Anifan, khabrukana. Is it khabrukana? Yes. yes, it is khabrukana. Huh? Shadid, violent, huh? fierce, very hard. Violent. Fakadin kalatil abuabu. Fakadin kalatil abuabu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fakadin kalatil abuabu. In kalaa. Disjointed. Came apart. Got dislocated. What is the meaning of this now, brothers and sisters? That overturning was so severe that the doors came off. Okay. But takassara zujaju. Takassara. Not break. Smash. Takassara means this form five. And the glass smashed into pieces. Everybody it's with me, inshallah. Okay. Al Mudaris. Ikra darsa yas talha. Talha. Now, this is very nice, very beautiful, brother. In kasafa. This shamsu. In kasafa. What is the meaning of in kasafa? Eclipse. Huh? To be eclipsed. Huh? The, there was a sun. Eclipse. Huh? Yawma mata Ibrahim. Hmm? When Ibrahim died. The day Ibrahim died. Huh? In kasafatish shamsu. Yawma mata Ibrahim. Fakala nasu. And the people say. In kasafat. Limauti Ibrahim. There is a sun in cliffs. Because of the death of Ibrahim. Are you with me, brother and sister? Look at it. I think you are quite strong. You will understand. Yawma. Zarf. With single fata. Yawma. Why? It is mudaf. So where is mudaf ilahi? Jumla failure. What is mudaf ilahi? The whole jumla failure. I think we have done it before. You will recall it, inshallah. فَقَالَ رَسُولُ اللَّهِ صَلَى اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ وَسَلَّمُ إِنَّ الشَّمْسَ وَالْكَمَرَ آيَتَانِ مِنْ آيَاتِ اللَّهِ Translation, brother. That the sun and the moons are two signs from the signs of Allah. لَا يَنْكَسِفَانِ لِمَوْتِ أَحْدٍ There is no eclipse, you know. If somebody dies for the death of somebody, they don't go and uh, have eclipse, you know. Well, hayatihi, and not for you know somebody's uh, uh, being alive, you know. For iza, okay, brothers and sisters, remember iza. For iza, for is her fuat. For iza, raytumuhuma. If you see them, you know, sun eclipse or moon eclipse, what do you see? Father, oh, Fa has come. Ta'ala, mashallah, because it is fellow Amr. See, now your mind can easily figure out, brother. Father, Allah. Huh? Then pray to Allah. Wasallu. Huh? And Amr again, brother. And 
Au fost sala hatta yanjaliya injala yanjata it is clear. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Rawahu Bukhari. It is mentioned by Bukhari. Man Ibrahimu. Man Ibrahimu haza ya ustad. Si man Ibrahimu haza. Not. No patal. Haza is come at the end. Huh? Man Ibrahimu haza. Haza is not. Who of no Nabi? He is son of Nabi. Min Mariatal Kibtiyati. Kibtiyati. Brother. Write down, brothers and sisters. Al Kiptu. What is Al Kiptu? People of Egypt before Islam. People of Egypt before Islam are called Al Kiptu. So Maria was, who was Maria? Al Kiptiyati. She was, you know, from these people. Radiallahu anha. Okay? Wabnu Nabi, he was the son of Nabi from Maria al Kiptiyati, radiallahu anha. Mafia, al Ismu Ibrahim, al Gairu Munsarifin Huwa, al Ismu Ibrahim, al Gairu Munsarifin Huwa, Nam, Lima, why? لِأَنَّهُ عَلَمٌ أَجَمِيٌ لِأَنَّهُ عَلَمٌ أَجَمِيٌ Because it is foreign name. Are you with me? Because it is foreign name. What is alamun here, brothers and sisters? خَبَرْ أَنَّا What is it? خَبَرْ أَنَّا لِأَنَّهُ so Anna is here, your menachwatu Anna, okay? Because it. So li Anna, li is after, but Anna is actually menachwatu Anna. Huh? And who is Ismu Anna? Huh? And Alamun is Khabar Anna. Please keep that in mind. Ah, Jamiun is your Naat, brother. Well, Alamul Ajamiyu and the foreign names, La Yan Sarifu. They do not decline. Okay? Like, in other words, they are diptot. Okay? Ghairu Mun Sarifin means it's diptot. What do we call it, brothers and sisters? Mamnu minasar. Gairu munsarifin means Mamnu minasar. Heard the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Okay. Now, I have got only five minutes more. I would like to read the key quickly, brothers and sisters. And then the rest of it, you will read it. And tomorrow we will finish this lesson quickly. And then we'll go to the next, inshallah. The next lesson will require, again, a little extra time. If you get a little time today, practice, brother. Do the verb conjugation. Bab in fa'ala. In this bab, brothers and sisters, in is prefix to fa'ala. Okay. The hamza is hamzatul wasal. We say, sakatal, sakatal finjanu wan kasara. Sakatal finjanu wan kasara. The teacup fell and broke, brother and sister. The mudaria, harful mudaria, brother, takes fata. Okay? In kasara, yan kasiru. In shakka, yan shakku. Fine, brother and sister. Amar we know very well. Master, on the pattern of in fi'alun. In kasara, in kisarun. In kalaba, in kilabun, brother. 
the assimilated letters get separated in mastar. In shakka becomes enchi ka koni. Okay? In the nakis rub, the final ya changes to hamza. Huh? In jala, inji laun. Inji laun for inji layun. Okay? The rest is very, very easy, brother. The noun of place and time. It is the same as ismul maful. Yan atifu, it bends. Mun atafun, place of bending. Got the idea, brother and sister? Road bend. Eh? The word munhana is also used in the same sense, brothers and sisters. This bab denotes mutawatu. Do you remember this mutawatu? Brothers and sisters? Have you forgotten? We did so much on this. Huh? So much we explained this bab, brother. It agrees. What happens in, in an al mutawa? Tawa. Yutavi uh, to, to agree to consent. Okay. So what happens, brother, here? Fatahtul ba ba. What did I say? Fatahtul ba ba. Okay. Now, where is the file? Tu. Where is mafulun bihi? Ba ba. Remove now file. And make the mafulun bihi into file. And bring it into this bab. Fatahtul baba will become in fatahal babu. Now this process is called mutawa. Brother, I better ask you to read again. I think I explained you in so much detail. I explained you a lot of detail, brother. One second. Lesson 20. Huh? Is that correct? Read it again, brother and sister. Read it again. And I wrote, I wrote many examples for you. Huh? Revise it. So that, you know, this concept is very strong in your understanding. Huh? Revise it, brothers and sisters, inshallah. And we will start from here tomorrow. Huh? I will start from this tomorrow and then go to the main lesson, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Nice to see you, brothers and sisters. We are going to do a little bit of revision again, brothers and sisters. Tava'a, form three. What is the meaning of tava'a? Wafaka, to agree. Ata'a, to obey. Wafaka is to agree. Ata'a is to obey. Wafaka, form three. Ata'a, form four. Okay. Now, al-mutawa'atu is the master from tava'a. Yutawi'u. And mutawi'un is a smooth file. What is the meaning of mutawi'un in grammar? That there is a verb and active voice, <clears throat> but with a passive voice meaning in relation uh, to another form of the same verb. Uh, okay? A verb and active voice, but with a passive meaning in relation to another form of the same verb. So, brothers and sisters, we have here kasartu zujaja. Kasartu. Form two. Okay? And then we say takasar zujaju. I smash the glasses to pieces. The next meaning is the glass smashed to pieces. Who did it? So that is, because we don't know who did it, it conveys the meaning of passive, majhul. Are you with me? It conveys the meaning of majhul. And you know in form 7, where the meaning of passive is conveyed, there is no mafulun bihi. It means they are intransitive. If there is no mafulun bihi means they are intransitive. Got the idea, brother and sister? Now, here is another example. So, there is a special relationship between form 2 and form 5. 
Now, فَتَحْتُ الْبَعْبَ Form 1. Huh? When you bring it in Form 7, in فَتَحَ الْبَعْبُ So, in other words, the مَفُولٌ بِهِ becomes the file. And the file is dropped. Huh? File gets dropped. Okay, brothers and sisters. I have written another, which is the relationship between <coughs> form 1 and form 8. Huh? Malatul Kuba. I fill the cup. And in form 8, what will happen? Imtala Kubu. Kubu, file. The cup was filled. Huh? The same thing is Rafatu Thauta. I raised the voice. In form 8, it will become Irtafa Sautu. The voice was raised, you know. So, in all these things, the file is two, which gets eliminated, which is omitted. Are you with me? So, this process is called Al Mutawa. Huh? So, signifying the meaning of Mutawiyun verb. What is Mutawiyun? A verb in an active voice, but with a passive meaning in relation to another form of the same verb. Right? This is all you have to remember, brother. And more example I have here. Alamtuhu, I taught him. What happened? He learned. Huh? So who mafulun bihi is the file in ta'allama. Huh? And zawashtuhu, I got him married. So what happened? He married. So where is who in here? Damir Mustatir. File. Remember? Akhartuhu. I delayed him. So what happened? He got delayed. Ta'akhara. Huh? Okay. So this is all you have to keep it in mind, brothers and sisters. Now, I'll quickly read, brothers and sisters, page 87 in the key. Hmm? This we are referring to form 5. Huh? This bab denotes, among other things, al mutawatu, which means that the object of a verb becomes the subject. Are you with me? The object of the verb in one form becomes the subject of the verb in another form. Okay? Example, zawajani Abi Zainaba. My father married me to Zainab. Here my father is the subject. Huh? And there are two objects, me and Zainab. Now if Bab Tafa'ala is used, Form 5 is used, I become the subject. Huh? And Zainab remains object. And my father has no role uh, no role in it, brothers and sisters. So when you bring it in form 5, what will happen? Tazawashtu Zainab. I married Zainab. This is it, brothers and sisters. This is the meaning of al mutawa I give you one more example, brother. Are you with me? I am not writing, but you will understand. Allamani Bilalun. What is the meaning of it? Allamani Bilalun. The Bilal, Bilal taught me Allugat al Arbiya. Bilal taught me uh, Arabic language. Now I bring it in form 5. Ta'allamtu Lugat al Arbiya. I learned Lugat al Arbiya. Are you with me? I give you one more example, brother. Allamani Muhammadun al Quran. Translation, brother. Muhammad taught me the Quran. Now I bring it in form five. Allamtu al Quran. I learned Quran. So this process is called Mutawa. Are you with me? This process is called Mutawa. Inshallah. Uh, you have noted it down 
And uh, you will uh, keep this in mind, inshallah, brothers and sisters. And you will revise the key of book three whenever you get an opportunity. Revise it. Huh? And that way, gradually, these things that we are learning will become permanent part of your understanding and your memory, inshallah. So we come to number four now in our that's brothers and sisters. What is the page number, Sister Hafsa? 191. Yufidu bab in fa'ala al mutawata. Are you with me? Yufidu, what is yufidu? Afada yufidu. Bab in fa'ala indicates. Huh? Al Mutawa, it indicates Al Mutawa. And what is Al Mutawa? Huh? Okay, you understood that. Takulu Fatahtul Baba Fan Fataha. Fan Fataha. So it opened. Brother and sister, Al Baba is Mafulun Bihi. It should become file. Has it become five? Huh? Has it become five? How do you know it is five? Damir Mustatir. Huh? Damir Mustatir. If you say in Fataha, what is the meaning of in Fataha? It opened. What is the meaning of in Fataha? It, it opened. So where is it? It is your file. Who? And that returns to Bab, huh? fine, brother. Tamalil Muthal, Thum Akmil Nakis, brother and sister. Al Muthal, Fatahtul Baba, In Fatahal Babu. Got the idea, brother and sisters? Kasartu Al Kuba. Are you with me, brother and sisters? Kasartul Kuba. What is the meaning of this sentence? I did not smash. I just broke. Huh? I did not smash. I just broke. Huh? What will be when you bring it into form uh, seven? In kasar al kub, the the cup broke. Huh? In kasar al kub. So can you see the mafulun bihi change into fire? Kataatul huh? habla. I cut the rope. What happens? In Katal Hablu. The rope got cut. Fine, brother and sister. Kalabtul Kitaba. I overturned the book. Kalabtul Kitaba. So what happened now? In Kalabal Kitabu. The book overturned. Hazam al Muslimun al Kufara. The Muslims defeated the Kufar. How will you say it in form seven, brothers and sisters? In Hazam al Kufaru. The Kufars were defeated. Mutawiu huh? Fa'ala. What is Fa'ala, brother? Form one. Are you with me? Mutawiu fa'ala in fa'ala. In other words, in fa'ala obeys fa'ala. Are you with me? Inshallah. Kama raita, as you saw. Amma fa'ala fa mutawiuhu tafa'ala. So, form one has a relation with form 7, and form 2 has a relation with form 5. And what kind of a relation? That the mafulun bihi becomes the file in other form, and conveys the meaning of passive, even though it is active. Are you with me? The verb is active, but it conveys the meaning of passive. Tamalil Misala. 
ثم اكمل الناكس كسرت الزجاج تكسر الزجاج we just had uh, talk about it a little while ago now you do it brother كتعت الحبل تقطع الحبل ما شاء الله okay this is done brother in kasara changes into an kasara okay اذا دخلت حمزه الاستفهام على انفعل حذفت حمزه الوصل حمزه الوصل is dropped is it clear brother and sister this is very easy huh? because hamza tul wasal cannot be pronounced if something comes in front of it so as it is not pronounced it is dropped okay brothers and sisters in writing also in pronunciation as well as in writing but you have to use your voice to indicate that it is a question an kasara what is the meaning of if i only say an kasara did it break did it break Fine, brothers and sisters. Now watch these sentences very carefully. Okay, brothers and sisters. Adkhil hamdat al istifam ala al jumal al aatiyati in kalabat al sayaratu. How will you say now? An kalabat al sayaratu. An kalabat al sayaratu. And a question mark, because when you use hamdat al istifam, you got to use question mark. Fine. In fataha babul matami. How do you say? An fataha babul matami. Did the door of the restaurant opened? Number third. In hazama mushrikun. What will you say now? An hazama al mushrikun. Fine. Aslama abuka. What will you do now? Aslama, this is a trick here for you. <laughs> you will use the same thing, but no, not here. <laughs> Form four. Aslama, no, you got to use because Aslama has got Hamzatul Kata, not Hamzatul Wasal. Huh? Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Now we have to get ready. to find out madi mudariya amr and uh, ismu fa'il and mastar waqa al kubu ala al ard what is the meaning of this sentence brother waqa to to fall down okay waqa al kubu the, the cup fell on the ground huh waqa al kubu ala al ard means the cup fell on the ground so what happened One kasara, it broke. Got the idea? So what is one kasara? Uh, in, in kasara is maadi. Ha babu la yanfatihu. This door doesn't open. It doesn't open. So let us analyze it. Ha za muqtada al babu badal la la nafia. This is la nafia. Yan fatihu fi'lun mudariyun marfuun bi dhamma. Fa'il mustatir takdiru huwa. Yadullu ala baab. Translation brother. This door does not open. That's it. Therefore, udkhul enter min baabil akhari. Hmm? Enter from the other door. Number third brother. This is a nice verb. tantafiu anwaru shawari what is the meaning of this anwaru shawari what is the meaning of this anwaru shawari street lights huh? you know on all the streets lights of all the streets tantafiu switched off huh? what is the verb intafa intafa Got the idea? Madi is in tafa. Okay, maybe I should write it down, brother. Eh? What is the madi? In 
How will you write down? Intafa to switch off. Yantafiu. How will you write down Yantafiu? Yantafi. Huh? And then. Oh. No dots, brothers and sisters, on the ya. Why? Because it is only a kursi. It is only a kursi for Hamza. Because before Hamza comes Kasra. Yantafi'u. Tantafi'u anwaru shawari fissa'atil khamisati sabahan at five o'clock in the morning. Okay. Sababun kilabi. Sababun kilabi sayarati. What is the meaning of this? Sababun Kelabis sayarati. The reason of the overturning of car. Right? In kalab is to overturn. Right? Sababu, what is sababu, brothers and sisters? Muftida. Muftida. Wahua? Mudaf. Where is mudafili? In kilab. What is in kilab? Master. Right? In kalaba? In kilab. Right? Okay. Wahua mudaf. And sayarati? Mudafilehi. Okay. Where is the khabar now? Yes. In fajar. In fajar. What is the meaning of in fajar? To explode. What is the meaning of in fajar? To explode. Huh? Blow out. Ehda ajala tihi. Ehda ajala tihi. Sababun kila vil sayarati. The reason of overturning of the car is the explosion of one of the tires. Huh? Ajalati is tires. This is plural. Huh? Ehda, one of the, one of its tires. Huh? Okay. The reason for overturning of the car is the blowing up of one of its tires. In Fijaru, is your khabar. Wahua mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi? Ehda. Wahua mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi? Ajalati. Wahua mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi? Ha. Final mudaf ilahi. Definite uh, noun. Ha. Got the idea? Inshallah. In hazam al mushrikuna fi gazwati badrin. What is the meaning of this, brother? The mushriks were defeated in the battle of Badr. The mushriks were defeated in the battle of Badr. Takharraja fil mahadil amal munsarima al amal munsarima. Brother, what is al am Zar. Huh? And al munsarima is your naat. Huh? What is the meaning of al munsarima? Mahdi. The year passed by. Are you with me? Huh? The year gone by. Huh? The year which elapsed. Huh? al am al munsarima. So what is Munsarima? Asam Fai. Huh? Okay. The year gone by. Okay. Takharraja fil mahadi al amal munsarima bidatun wa salasuna taliban. Okay, brothers and sisters. Brother Hassan. Takharraja. What kind of a verb is this? Form 5. Huh? What is the meaning of takharraja? He graduated. Huh? Where is the file? Now you have to look to the whole sentence. Brother Muhammad, where is the file?
Bidatun is your file. Bidatun, see, file is marfu. So you got to look. Bidatun. What is the meaning of bidatun, brother? Write it down. This is a nice verb. This is muzakkar. And bidatun is muannas. Several, or even say few. Okay? Or even you can say some. In English we say more than 30. How many more? Few more than 30. Are you with me? How do you say in then Arabic? Bid'atun or bid'un. Okay. Now, look at the sentence, brothers and sisters. Bid'atun is your file. Huh? What is the meaning of the sentence? Takharraja fil mahadi al amil munsarima. The year gone by, last year or past year. Huh? More than 30 students graduated. Are you with me? You got the meaning? More than 30 students graduated. Okay, brother. Now we come to Bidatun. What is Bidatun? File. Huh? And then Harfu Atf. And what is Falathuna? Ma'atufuna la Bidatun. And what is Taliban? Tamiz. Huh? Okay, brother, look at it. If the <coughs> Ma'adud is Muzakkar, the number becomes Mu'anas. That is why it is bid'atun. Okay, now let us change the ma'adud. And let us say talibatan. Now what will happen to the sentence? Takharrajat, we will say. Okay, are you with me? And what will happen to this? Bid'atun. Write down, brother, in your note. What will you write down? Bid'atun wa salathuna talibatan. What will you write, brothers and sisters? Bid'un wa salathuna talibatan. Because now talibatan is madud, mu'annas, so we have to make it, then adad, muzakkar, bid'un. These are all small, small things, but they are very important to keep it in mind. Very good, brothers and sisters. Safar al farikul munhazimu. Translation, brother. Safara, you know Safara, form? Form three, okay. Farik is a team. Munhazim, the losing team, the team which was defeated. Huh? So, what will you say in your translation? The losing team left. Or traveled. Huh? Got the idea of the sisters? Alhamdulillah. Now comes another very beautiful and important thing. In Kasafat Shamsu, Yawma Mata Ibrahimu. Okay? See, Yawma. This is your Zarf. Here, it comes as a Mudaf. We don't say it is Mudaf, but we understand. It as a mudaf. Where is mudaf ilihi? The whole sentence. The whole jumla failure, brother, will come as a mudaf ilihi. Now, this style comes in the Quran a lot. And we got to understand it well, brother and sisters. So, brother and sisters, mata fi'alun madin babnin ala fata. Ibrahimu fa'il. Al jumlatul fi'aliyatu. Fi mahalli jarrin. Mudafili. That's the way you will say it. Huh? Okay. In Kasafatish Shamsu, the sun was eclipsed the day Ibrahim died. Huh? So you will be watching this kind of a construction in the Quran also, brothers and sisters. Huna al Jumlatu Mata Ibrahimu Mudafun il. Ilayha. Wa hiya fi mahalli jarrin. Wa yawma mudafun. 
Ha-amsilatan ukhara. Khud, take more example. Safartu yawma zahratin nata'ayju. What is the meaning of this? Zahratin nata'ayju. I travel the day the results were appeared. Huh? Or the results were announced or declared. But appeared is the right translation here. I travel the day results appeared. So brother, what is it? Yawma, zarf. Are you with me? And then zahara, fiel mahdi, ta 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 nisi. And where is the file? Nataij. Huh? What is the meaning of nataij? Results. Singular. Natija. Huh? It's in Urdu also. You know it. Huh? Next sentence, brother. Marittu. What is the meaning of marittu? I became sick. I got sick. Marittu yauma. I got sick the day. What happened on that day? Zar al waziru al jamiata. The minister visited the university. Okay? So marittu yauma. Zar al waziru jamia. Very good, brothers and sisters. You understand now? So, Zara is your Felu Madin, Mabnun al Afata, Al Waziru, File, Marfu'un, and Al Jamiata, Mafu'un bihi. MashaAllah. Wa Al Jumlatul Fialiyatu, Fi Mahalli Jar, Mudafilehi. Wulitu. What is the meaning of bulittu? I was born. I was born. Brother, what kind of a verb is this? Majhul. Where is knife file, Brother Hassan? Tu. Tu. Bulittu. Tu is your knife file. Bulittu. I was born. Brothers and sisters, bulittu. Yawma, the day. What happened on that day? Mata Jaddi. Where is the file of Mata? Jaddu. Jaddu. Huh? Huh? So that is the way it is, brothers and sisters. A Jumla failure can come after Zarf and it will be, the whole Jumla will be Mudafili. Okay? Now see, the beauty of book three, that more verses of Quran are brought to us. Eh? So that we can un- see those things straight into the verses of the Quran. Fit Tanzili. Tanzili is the Quran, brother. Haza. What is Haza? Muptita. And what is Yaumu? Khabar. It is khabar. Huh? It is your khabar. Huh? What is the meaning of this is the day. This is the day. Okay. Fine. Now after Yaumu, brothers and sisters, you, you know, I will not call it zarf now. Because zarf has to be mansoon. Huh? Zarf has to be. Do you know that? Or you don't know this. Zarf has to be mansoon. Huh? So here it is not zarf. Brother. Here it is a noun. Are you with me brother and sister? Haza, this is the day. Okay, now it is coming as a mudaf. Bahuwa mudaf. We can say here, huwa mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi brother and sisters? Yanfa'u sadikina sidakuhum. Brother Muhammad, Yanfa'u. What is the meaning of Yanfa'u? What is Madi of Yanfa'u? Nafa. Nafa. Huh? Nafa, Yanfa'u. Masha'Allah. What is the meaning of Nafa? To benefit. Huh? To benefit. Okay. Where is the file of Yanfa'u? Nobody will answer? No. Look at the sentence. You've got to look at the sentence. Huh? No, that is, that is not Marfu, brother. Still go further, what is left now? (laughs) 
Sit, go, see, can you see, marfo? That's the way we are going to understand the Quran, brother. You will read it thoroughly. Huh? So where is the file of Yanfo? Sid Kuhum. Huh? And what is and what is uh, Sad Kina? Huh? Mafulun Bihi. Uh, it is Mafulun Bihi, brothers and sisters. Sidku, brothers and sisters, here is truthfulness. Huh? Honesty. Truthfulness and honesty. This is the day, eh? the honesty of them hmm, will benefit, okay, those who were truthful. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Who, their honesty will benefit those who were truthful. So, sadikun, sadikuna, sadikina, okay? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Their truthfulness will benefit the truthful people. Okay, brother. Here is another explanation of Zarf and Mudafilihi. Yawma Mata Ibrahimu Takdiruhu Yawma Mauti Ibrahima. Mata became Mauti. Got the idea? Inshallah. Now you see, Mauti is a noun, it's a master. Okay? So you got it, huh? Now, brothers and sisters, we are going to learn the next thing, which is very, very interesting and detailed, inshallah. Brothers and sisters, I wrote down on the board. Hmm? Don't tell me you forgot this also. Huh? What is love? Harf imtinai, lim tenai. What happens in the love? The first one. Brother, it is harf. Huh? It indicates that the second thing failed to materialize because the first thing did not happen. Huh? Okay? Okay. Love ishtahatta la najahta. The second thing, najahta, you did not succeed, did not materialize, did not happen because the first thing did not happen. You did not work hard. Uh, that's the way it is to be understood. Always in these two cases, we'll start with the second thing first. Remember, la la is one word, not two. One word. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? La la is one word. Now, what is the meaning of la la? Again, it is harfu imtenai. What is imtenai? In order, what is imtinai? Master. From form, from form eight. What is the word? Imtana'a. 
What is the meaning of imtana? To become impossible. To be or become impossible. Huh? Now, inshallah, you will recollect your uh, thoughts. So, harfu imtanai. Again, harfu imtanai goes to the second thing. Li wujudi is the first thing. Imtana hudusul fi'alithani. The second action did, did not happen or it became impossible, did not happen. Why? Li wujudi fi'alil awal. Because of the presence of the first. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So please remember this. Now we are going to study the lesson. Is it clear? No, because you need an example. You need an example. Okay? Let us I write down the example. That will make more sense, inshallah. I am writing this from the dars. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? A salima rukabu. A salima rukabu. Did the passenger survive? Were they safe? What was the answer? Naam. Salimu. Can you go into the main lesson, brothers and sisters, of uh, lesson 22? Can you find it? As Salima Rukabu, was the passenger safe? Did they escape injury? Huh? We are talking about the main lesson. Huh? What is the 188? What is the next line? Naam. 189. I have a different book. My notes are in a different book, brother and sister. Naam Salimu. They, they escaped. They survived. They were safe. Okay. Well, alhamdulillah. What is the next line, brother? Laula. Fadlullahi alayhim lamatu. But for the grace of Allah. Huh? But for the grace of Allah, they would have died. But they did not die. Intana hudusi fairly thani. The the jawab which is fail thani, huh? or the action you can say, it did not take place. They did not <laughs> die. Why is it that they did not die? Because the first thing was Maujud. What was Maujud? Fadlullah was Maujud. Are you with me? Is it clear? Brother Hassan? Brother Muhammad? Because the Fadlullah was there, okay, therefore they did not die. So we say, Lawla. Now you can say, if the grace of Allah was not there, they would have died. Are you with me? Fine, brothers and sisters. What is lawla? What is lawla? Harfu imtanai li wujud. Always you will say this. Eh? Inshallah, when you will revise, often, brothers and sisters, uh, it will become part of your memory. I must remind you, brothers and sisters, this is an intensive course. Eh? There are things you will understand quickly. There are things you may not understand. Every single day we are coming here. Every single day we are learning more. And every single day you have to go home and revise. And if you can't revise, 
you will fall behind. My job is here to explain you as much as I can, brother, in all my sincerity. Huh? The rest lies in your court, brother and sister. You got to work hard. And remember, this is intensive course. We are trying to finish something in seven months, which normally takes more than two and a half years. And we are doing it in seven months. Okay? So you have to understand the pressure is there. Uh, you got to cope with it. Huh? You got to cope with it, inshallah. The, that's why I, my suggestion from the very beginning has been that you should become strong in conjugation. Okay? And the rest of the things, you make a note of it. And then as you will re uh, revise them, things will become very clear. And now, to top this all off, you will get the DVDs. So that will help you, brother. Huh? This was not in the planning. It just happened all of a sudden that the idea was put forth in, in our committee and our committee said that if this is going to benefit the students, let's do it. So inshallah, when the DVDs will come out, you will then be able to revise it at your own pace. There will be no pressure on you. Inshallah. Okay. But right now, you should be ready to you know, work hard as much as you can. There are only 14 lessons left. You have come a long way. And if you reflect on what you have learned in this last six months, brothers and sisters, you have learned a lot. You came here with nothing. And you learned a lot. Now, do you want to give up? No, brothers and sisters, work hard. Do not, do not be, become lazy. Work hard, brothers and sisters. No excuses. Huh? No excuses. Just work hard, brothers and sisters. So, you will always say, Lao, Hafim Tenai, Lim Tenai. This is a technical grammar term. Lao, La, Hafim Tenai, Li Wujud. Brother, what is Wujud? Wajada, huh? Wujud. Something which is found. Okay? Which is present. Huh? Which is present. Okay, brothers and sisters. After Lao, La, Muftada will come. What will come? Muftada. Now we are all very strong in Muftada. Whenever I say Muftada will come, I see smiles on your faces. Because it's easy. We will understand it. Huh? Where is Muftada, brother? Fadlu. Fadlu only. Wahua. Mudaf. Where is Mudaf ilayhi? Allah. Where is our khabar? Where is our khabar? The khabar is diamond mahzuf. Ma diamond mahzuf. If there is a muftida, then the khabar will be always mahzuf. And what will that khabar be? What is the khabar? Mawjudun. And that will be my zuf, brother. Khabarun. Khabarun. Khabarun, my zufun. Are you with me? Always. Okay, now, brothers and sisters, alayhim is jar majur. The same rules. Allamu waqiyatun fi jawab. Where is the jawab? Matu. Where is the jawab? Matu. So lam came. When will lam come? If there is no negation. If there is a negation, then the lam won't come. Now this is also a rule we have to remember. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? If you will read the sentences, keeping these rules in mind, it's very easy. And you will become very strong. Inshallah. So, la matu came. Now, brothers and sisters, the jawab of laula will always be, are you listening? Sister Mamuna, Sister Mana, the jawab of laula 
will always be fail Mahdi. Huh? Will always be fail Mahdi. Huh? See? Laula harfu imtinai li wujud. Fadlu mubtada. Wahua mudaf. Allahi mudaf ilayhi. Where is the khabar? Mahzuf. What is the taqdiruhu? Mawjudun. Huh? And then la allamu fi jawab is shart. Waqiyatun fi jawab is shart. And where is the jawab? Matu. What is matu? Fi al maadi. Fi al maadi. Mabniun ala damma. Where is the file? Al wow. Where is the file? Al wow. But these things are simple and easy. I hope you will remember it. There is nothing that cannot be understood. Because we have been doing this thing all along for the past few months. Where is the file? What is the fail? The only thing, if you are strong in your conjugation, you will have no difficulties. Fine. Did you understand this, brothers and sisters? Now we come to the Number nine. Laula fadlullahi alayhim lamatu. Laula. Page number. Sister Hafsa. Page number. 190. 193. Laula. What is laula? Harfu imtina'in. Wa taddallu ala imtina'i. Jawab. And it directs you to, indicates you to, uh, impossibility of the jawab. Inshallah. Li wujud is shart. Because of the presence of the shart. And which is, what is the shart? Fadlullah. Uh, it is your shart. Uh, it is present. That is why the jawab becomes impossible. It will not materialize. It will not take place. It will not happen. It will not occur. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Here is another beautiful example. Law lal hawau. What is the meaning of this? Law lal hawau. If there were no air. Huh? Or, we can say in English, but for the air. What will you say? But for the air. What would have happened? Lahalakan nasu. The people would have perished. They would have died. Did the people die? Why? Because the hawa is mawjud. Are you with me? Why the people did not perish? Why? Because the hawa is mawjud. So lawla, what will you say? Lawla, harfum tenai li wujud. Fine, brothers and sisters. And what is al hawau? Where is the khabar? What is that khabar? Mawjudun. Mawjudun is your khabar. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? And then the lamb has come. Because the jawab is affirmative. There is no negation. Okay, brothers and sisters. Halaka, sister Maimuna. Halaka, fiel mahdi. Remember. The verb in the jawab has to be maadi. And what is a nasu? What is a nasu, brother Hassan? Halakan nasu? Five. 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 Got to understand this, brother. Inshallah. That is to say, wujid al hawau, the hawa is found. Are you with me? Falam. Yahlakin nasu. So the people did not perish. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Now remember the next thing, brother. Watayati law ma aidan bihadal ma'ana. So you can have lawla or lawma. Same meaning. Hafim tinai, hafim tinai, li wujudin. Are you with me, brothers and sisters, inshallah? (coughs) 
al ismul waqiu the verb which is occurring al waqiu occurring ba'daha after it what is it mubtada hudifa khabruhu the khabar is omitted okay wa lawla hawau taqdiruhu lawla hawau mawjudun brother highlight mawjudun do something about maujud so that when you revise you understand are you with me brothers and sisters but for the air that is what you will say brothers and sisters okay wa qad taati ba'daha and wa qad taati taati is mudariya and qad has come means maybe huh? it can kat taati baada anna instead of mubtada anna will come and if an comes what comes after it wasmuha wa khabruha it is possible nahu laula annani maridun la safartu what is the translation but for the fact that i am sick Huh? I would have traveled. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? But for the fact I am sick, huh? I would have traveled. Now, in this case, there is no room for khabar being mazuf. It does not apply here. The khabar mazuf will only apply if there is a muftida. Is there is there any muftida here? No, brothers and sisters. What do we have after lawla? Huh? Anna, huh? min akhwatu inna. And if anna comes, then we have ism. Is there a ism? Yes, ya mutakalam. Is there a khabar? Yes, there is a khabar. And then lam came. Why? Jawab. Huh? Is there any negation? No, the lam has to come. And what is the verb, sister Mamuna? Madi, madi. La safartu. I would have traveled. Alhamdulillah. You understood, inshallah, brothers and sisters. No, I forgot one word, brother. La safartu maaka. I would have traveled with you. Remember, I forgot maa. So the meaning is, I would have traveled with you. But for the fact that I am sick, I would have traveled with you. Uh, inshallah you got it brothers and sisters okay brothers and sisters inshallah you understood the concept of lavla and so we are not reading the key it's very easy for you to now follow the key inshallah uh, but you will always remember in the case of love and lavla you will start with the second thing with the jawab in the case of love the second thing did not happen because the first thing did not happen huh? in lawla the second thing did not happen because the first thing was present that's the difference inshallah you will always start with the second huh? you will always start with the jawab huh? okay and then come to the shart what is the next sentence brother wa jawabu hal musbatu What is musbatu? Affirmative. Jaktarinu bil lam. Then it is connected with lam. If the jawab is affirmative, then it is connected with lam. Nahu. Here is the Quran, brother. Lau la antum the kuffar. Brother will. will blame others the people will blame on the yawm yawm qiyama huh? what they will say laula antum la kunna mu'minin if you were not there we would have been moments you know they will say okay so this is from quran okay brother let us analyze laula harf imtinai Huh? See, 
Antum, what is Antum? Mubtada. Are you with me? Dameerun munfasilun. Marfu. Mubtada. Where is the khabar? Mawjudun. Khabar is? Mawjudun. Lakunna mu'min. We would have been mu'min. If you had not been present, we would have been mu'min. But you were present and you misguided us. We, we, we went astray. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. La kunna. I ask you, what is kunna? Brother uh, Muhammad, what is kunna? No. no, no, no. Brother, uh, brother. Okay, Abir, what is kunna? Kana, mashallah. Kana. Excellent. So what is, it is, Fiyal Mahdi. Huh? Remember, Jawab has to be Fiyal Mahdi. Huh? Kunna. Okay. Kana. Kana. Kanu. Kanat. Kanata. Kunna. Kunta. Kuntuma. Kuntum. Kunti. Kuntuma. Kuntunna. Kuntu. Kunna. So where is this Mukana? Na. Huh? And where is the Khawar Kana? Huh? Mominina. What is this Mominina? Jama Muzakar Salam. And in what uh, uh, condition it is? Mansu. Khabar Kana Mansu. So Mominuna became Mominina. So how will you define Mominina? Khabar Kana Mansubun wa alamatu nasbihi aliyahu liannahu Jama Muzakar Salam. Brothers and sisters, these things should come to us now, quickly, in our mind. And if you will work hard, what shall I tell you? You will become masters, and you are going to enjoy it. You will become experts, and you'll, you are going to enjoy saying these things and, and understanding these things, inshallah. So the actual sentence is, Lawla antum mawjudun. Lakunna mu'mineen. Ha'a amsilatan ukhra. Take more examples. Li lawla. For lawla. Lawla l'ikhtibaru. What is lawla? What is ikhtibaru? Muftada. What is it? Examination. What is it now ikhtibar? Master from form... Eight. What is the verb? Ikhtabara yakhtabiru. Ikhtibar. Examination. But for the examination, you will say, or you can also say, had it not been for the examination, or you can say, but for the examination, ma hadartu al yawm. But that there is no la. Lam here. Why? Because it's negation. There is no need for lam. Mahadatu. Huh? Translation, brother. Had it not been for the examination, I would not have attended. Find them. I, I attended because there is examination. Laulash shamsu. Laulash shamsu maujudun. Huh? But for the sun, lahalakatil ardu. Translation, brother. If it had not been for the sun, the earth would have perished. Huh? Are you with me? So look at the jawab. Lam came because it is a no negation here, affirmation. And halaka is the verb madi. Huh? And halakatish, tautani si, and where is the file? Al ardu. The file is al ardu. Very good, Raju. Oh, what is this, brothers and sisters? Laula al hayau, la wakaina. What is this, brother? What is haya? What is haya? What do you call haya in English? Shame, shyness. Modesty. Huh? It is also modesty. Huh? Lawlal hayahu 
La Bakaina. What is the translation? But for the modesty, uh, we would have wept. We would have wept. So, Lam came, brother. And what kind of a verb is it? Mahdi. Uh, baka Yabki. Bakaina. Uh, so, Lawlal Hayau Maujudun. La Bakaina. Okay. I have a very beautiful example to give you. My teacher had, uh, when this thing came, uh, he knew I used to enjoy poetry. So he gave me an Arabic poetry, a very old Arabic poetry. I'm going to write it, brother. You are going to like it, inshallah. Lawla, now comes Anna. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Lawla, Anna. So, brother, where is the Ismu Anna? Ka. Where is Khabar? Mustajilun. Law la Anna ka mustajilun. But for the fact you are in hurry, la the autuka ila al baiti. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Law la Anna ka mustajilun, la the autuka ila al baiti. I would have invited you to the house. Uh, but since you are busy, I'm not inviting you. Uh, you know, here, there's no case of khabar being ma'zuf. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now let me write down this example, brother. Did you write it, brothers and sisters? Okay, brothers and sisters. Li Jaririn. What is the meaning of Li Jaririn? Jaririn is the name of the poet. When you say Li, means he wrote it. Huh? Brothers and sisters, this is a goes to the you know time of uh, uh, the Khilafat of uh, Umayyads. You know. You know, the Arabic literature, brothers and sisters, and Arabic poetry is nothing new. It's 2,000 years old, maybe more than that. The art of poetry was so common and prevalent in the Arab society before the advent of Islam. Before the coming of Islam, the art of Arabic was very prevalent. Everybody knew the language very well. Everybody enjoyed it. And the poets were uh, the elite of the society. Huh? And they were given honor as a you know, special, special 
high positions in the society. So, the, the, the present day English is only 500 year old, brother. But the, the rest of the world then copied the art of poetry from Arabs. There may be other, uh, you know, cultures too with poetry, but Arabs were very much ahead of everybody. So, brother and sisters, Jarir's wife died, and he loved her very much. Huh? And he wrote many poetries uh, in her honor. But in this he says, you know, Laulal Hayau, had it not been for the modesty, and shyness, la'adani istibaru. What is the meaning of la'adani istibaru? La bakaitu alaika. I would have wept uh, for you in front of everybody. You passed away, and I kept quiet because I was shy to cry. Uh? Okay, brothers and sisters, la'ad. Now you have to tell me. Lau, harfim tenai livojud al hayau muftada. Where is the khabar? Masuf. What is the meaning of that? Maujudun. Okay. Then lam came. Lam is for jawab. No. Where is the jawab? Ada. Felmati. Ada. What is the meaning of Ada? Raja. Uh, return. Adani. Noon Vikaya and Ya Mutakalam is your Mafulun Bi. Ni is the author. I mean, Ya Mutakalam is the author. What is this, brother? Istiabar. What kind of a verb is this? At least you know it is form 10. You know it is master. And you know it is form 10. MashaAllah. See, all these things help. Now, you knew it is form 10. You also knew it is master. But you did not know the meaning. This is going to be our status when we'll study Quran. We'll figure out everything. The only thing which we'll lack will be our vocabs. And then you have to go to the dictionary and find out the vocabs. And we have the word by word meaning of the Quran by Dr. Moharali from England. And that helps you a lot. Huh? It's just masterpiece, brothers and sisters. So, brothers and sisters, I write here. What is the meaning of istabara? To cry. <laughs> to cry. Huh? So, what will be the istabar? Bukaun. What will be? Bukaun. Huh? Baka. What will be the master? Bukaun. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Hmm? So, laul al haya, la adani, Means the crying would come. I would be weeping openly for you. Huh? Had it not been for the for the modesty and shyness, I would have wept for you openly in front of everybody. But I don't do that. Wala zurtu kabraki. Wa zurtu kabraki. Again, huh? again, brothers and sisters, wow has come. So, and what is la? Again, it mautu fonala, the first one. Huh? La ulal hayau, la zurtu kabraki. Had it not been for the shyness and modesty, I would visit your grave and cry there huh? for you. Huh? See, see the purity of love. Huh? The purity and innocence of the love. No vulgarness. La zurtu. So in other words, 
لا زورتو ازموتو فنالا لا عادا اری ریتمی بدن چشتا لا زورتو کبراکی و الحبیبو یوزارو what is الحبیبو here here الحبیب means محبوب what is it الحبیب means محبوب and the محبوب is visited you know it is normal for person to visit the loved ones are you with me now even you know it is normal to visit your mahboob the loved one but i don't visit why because of the haya are you with me so al habibu whether it applies to muannas and muzakkar together huh? and it means here al habib means bi ma'na ismu maful mahboob huh? you can write down bi ma'na mahboob Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Do you got the idea? This is a nice poem. Inshallah, you will... Yuzaru is majhul. Yuzaru is majhul. Huh? You know, it is uh, visited. Ah. Huh? Okay. The, the, you know, it is normal uh, uh, that the loved ones are visited. The loved one is visited. Huh? Okay. Inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now we move forward. I hope you liked it. I, I really loved it. Huh? This is a very beautiful poem, Inshallah. Lau lal ilmu. Now you got to fill in the blanks. Brothers and sisters. Akmil ma yali. Complete the following. What is it, brothers and sisters? Lau lal ilmu. What would you say now? Lakunna jahilin. Lakunna jahilin. We would have been jahils, ignorance. Huh? But for the knowledge, we would have been ignorant. Well, now you can say anything you want, huh, brother? You want to say something else? You can say that, huh? You can also say, brother and sister, Lawla al-ilmu La jahila nasu La jahila nasu The mankind would be ignorant, brother. Very beautiful sentence. Now see, now the exercises are here. What does it mean? You got to do it. You got to write it. You got to work on it. Because it is important uh, for us to do these things and get stronger. Lawla al-Islamu. What would happen, brother? La dalla nasu. The mankind would have been, mankind would have gone astray. La dalla nasu. La dalla nasu. La. Yes. Dallan Nasu. Got the idea, brothers and sisters, inshallah? Now comes Laula Annaka Maridun. But for the fact that you are sick. La da'autuka ila bayti. Lawla anna al-barda shadeedun. See, now an comes with ism and khabar. Lawla anna al-barda 
Shadidun. What would have happened? Yes, mashallah. Lazhabna ila suki. Lazhabna ila suki. Yes. Alhamdulillah. See, now it is coming to you. You know, the answers are coming to you, inshallah. Is it correct, brother and sister? You got it? A good, good understanding here? What is next one, brother? Next one is halwa puri. What is next one? Huh? Halwa puri. What did I write, brothers and sisters? Man haza rajulu. What is haza? And what is rajulu? Man haza rajulu. Here, man is a khabar. And haza is muqtada. Okay, man is a ismu istifam. Here it is khabar. Man haza rajulu. Your answer will be haza rajulu. So that indicates that the haza is muqtada. Muqtada in the first sentence and muqtada in the Second sentence as your answer. Man hazar rajulu, hazar rajulu, mudarrisu. This man is a teacher. Fine. So man hazar rajulu, haza, muftada, and what is rajulu? Badal. Now, brother and sister, manar rajulu haza. Now, what is haza? Not. Now, haza is a not. Now, haza is a not. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That's it. That's your lesson. Okay? Man Ibrahimu haza. So haza is a naat. Haza huna naatun li Ibrahim. Yakunus musharati naatan izavaka baad al alam. If it occurs after the proper noun. Aw muarraf bilidafati. What is the meaning of muarraf? Marifa. This is Muarraf is here. It's a mafool. It's a mafool. Huh? Or it becomes definite. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Belidafati. Now, let us see. We know, brothers and sisters, that Mudaf, Mudaf, Ilehi. Okay? Mudaf becomes definite huh? if the Mudaf, Ilehi is definite. And remember, Haza is definite. If haza comes as a naat, then manut has to be definite. Uh, and in mudaf, you don't see the sign of anything being definite. Uh, there is no al there in, in mudaf. So how do we know mudaf is definite? Because if the mudaf ilahi is definite, then we know mudaf is also definite. So this is the meaning of it. Aw muarraf belidafati. Now, man... Hamidun haza. So haza is your naat. Arini saataki hazihi. Are you with me? Arini saataki hazihi. Brothers and sisters, look at it carefully. Ari amar. Felu amrin mabnun ala hazfi harfi illa. Fail mustatir. Takdiruhu anta. And what is this? Noon vikaya. And ya mutakallam, what will I call it? Mafulun bihi number one. Huh? Mafulun bihi number one. Saata. Mafulun bihi number two. Wahua mudaf. And ka is mudaf ilahi. Now tell me, brothers and sisters, is saata definite or indefinite? Why? I don't see al. Ka is Ka, zameer, dameers are all definite. Huh? Remember. All pronouns are definite. This thing we must always remember. All pronouns are definite. Whether it is uh, ismu ishara or ismu mausula, 
or it is uh, the mere munfasil, the mere muttasil, all of them are definite. Brother. So in, in other words, sata is definite. So the nath has to be definite. Is hazihi definite? Yes, it is definite. So what is hazihi? Is a nath for sata. Inshallah. Fine. Liman jawazu safari haza. Whose passport is this? Okay. So haza is, brother and sister, what is haza? Nath. Nath for what? Jawazu. Bas, brother. That's all. One more example. A maftuhatun gurfatul mudarisina tilka. Tilka. What is the meaning of tilka here, brother and sister? It's a nath. Nath for what? Gurfat. Are you with me? Yeah? Gurfat. Huh? Translation, brother. Is that of the teachers open? Okay, brothers and sisters. Now remember, whether man hadar rajulu, man rajulu haza, translation will, in English translation, it will not change, brother. But only because Arabic grammar is very specific. When you write a sentence, number one, then haza is mubadal minhu. What is it? Huh? From where the badal comes. And what is in the second re- uh, sentence haza is a naat. But translation wise, it will remain same. Fine, brothers and sisters. With Tanzili now comes Quran, brothers and sisters. See, this knowledge of ours will help us to understand Quran. What is it, brother? Idhab bi kitabi haza. What is the meaning of Idhab bi kitabi haza? Go with my book. Huh? Or take my book. Huh? Okay. Go with the letter. Okay. Here it is go with the letter. Huh? But this is, uh, uh, yes. Huh? Go with the letter. It's not a book here. It's go with a letter. Go with my letter. How will you say? Go with a letter of mine. Okay, wa alki ilayhim. What is what is alki? Uh, Brother uh, Hassan, what is alki? We got to know it, brother. We must know it. Huh? Okay, let me ask. Uh, I'll ask Sister Aisha. She's very quiet. Sister Aisha, what is alki? Uh, sister. Uh, she answered, what is it? Amar, mashallah, mashallah. Now tell me the verb. And the form. Alka, form for mashallah. But this is the way our, we should be strong now. And if we are weak, what is the solution? Just conjugate. Do your conjugation as much as you can, brother. So, brother. Alka. Yulki and the Amar will be Alki. Huh? And what is this Ha after Alki? Mafulun bihi. Huh? But it is a silent, you know. Okay? We are going, you know, how Sakti, silent Ha. Okay? When you stop at some place, then you uh, make it silent, brother. Ilayhim. Thumma and then Tawalla. What is this Tawalla? Sister Madina? Palm five, mashallah, mashallah. And what is this? Amar. What is the verb? Huh? Tawalla. What is it? Tawalla. Ya tawalla. Make it Amar. Tawal. Tawalla. No, brothers and sisters, I've been repeating it for a long time. Strong, the more strong you are in verb, you are going to enjoy. 
the Quran, study of Quran and everything. Otherwise you will be struggling. Huh? And this course will make you very strong if you are hard, brothers and sisters. Okay. The ball is in your court. You take it and make a good use of it, brothers and sisters. Thumma tawalla. And then turn. Huh? Turn from them. Huh? Then return from them. Fine, brothers and sisters. Fil hadisi kala nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam la ali la ahujju bada ami hada. Why is this hadith has come here? Because to tell us that hada is a naat. Huh? Is it clear, brother? Hada is a naat. Naat for what? Huh? Ami. Huh? For the year. Fine. Number 11, brothers and sisters. Number 11 is Lima. Hadihi hausat. This is a silent ha. Brother. For you tabihi fil waqfi. And it is brought when you stop at reading, brother. Kama fi kawli ta'ala. Wa ma adra kama hiya. It is brought when you stop. Uh, then it becomes silent, brother. Fine, brother and sister. In the shamsa wal kamara ayatani. How do you think, brother and sisters? In the shamsa wal kamara ayatani. La yan kasifani. A damiru fi yan kasifani. What is the damir in yan kasifani, brother and sisters? What is the Damir? Aleph. Huma. Huh? Damir is Aleph, which is filed. But brother, it says Yan Kasifani. That is Muzakkar. Are you with me? That is Muzakkar. So, what happens, brothers and sisters? That we have a Shams. In a Shamsa, which is Muannas, well, Kamara, which is muzakkar, and you use the verb muzakkar. Why? Huh? That is the rule in Arabic language, and it is called at taghlib. Huh? Taghlib. What is taghlib? Master. What is the verb? Ghallaba. You ghallibu. Taghlib. What is the meaning of taghlib, brothers and sisters? You treat the combination of the word monas and muzakkar as muzakkar. Huh? What is it, brother? To treat a combination of masculine and feminine elements as muzakkar. Write it down, brother. To treat the combination Masculine and Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That's it. Huh? So, Yanka Sifani, Yaudu Ila Shams, Wal Kamar. It returns to both sun and moon. Wahuma, Monasun, Wa Mudakarun. And they are Monas and Mudakarun. Wa Jia, brother, Jia is Jia B. This is Majhul. Jia B means it is brought. Huh? Remember, brothers and sisters? Ja'a, uh, Ja'a Yaji'u. Ja'a, he came. But when you say Ja'a bi, 
to bring. Ata to come. Ata be to bring. So you see, for Jia be and it is brought. Bilfil be sigatil muzakkari tagliban. Are you with me, brother? So the form of muzakkar is brought. Huh? Tagliban means the treatment of muannas and muzakkar. We take it as a masculine. That's it, brother. Sir. Yugallabul muzakkar wala muannas. Huh? Okay, brother. Yugallabu here means the muzakkar is given priority over muannas. Okay? Huh? And what is the example? Abnai wa banati. See, muzakkar and muannas. Abnai wa banati yadrusuna. Huh? Bil jamiyati. Got the idea, brother and sister? Yadrusuna bil jamiyati. Okay. That's it, brother and sisters. Next one. Let's take a tea break. Inshallah. Alhamdulillah, brothers and sisters. We are back from our break. Hope you enjoyed it. You are energized. Uh, now, the batteries are recharged. <laughs> Number 13. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huna al-halu ma'zufatun. There is a hal which is ma'zuf. Are you with me, brother and sister? Is, what is the meaning of is? And then, takdiru uh, kalami, and then the estimation of the speech. Fa'iza raytumu huma mun kasifaini. What is it, brother and sister? Mun kasifaini. What is this mun kasifaini? Uh, let us let us go to the root. It is ism. Uh, it is ism file. Uh, in kasafa, yan kasifu, mun kasifu. Make it dual, brother and sister. Mun kasifani. Make it now uh, mansub. Mun kasifani. Mun kasifani. Munkasi faini. Okay, brothers and sisters. So that is munkasi faini is mansub and it is the hal. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So this is mazuf. So faiza raitumu huma. If you see both of them, who are these both of them? Ashamsu wal kamaru. Sun and moon. In what condition you see them? In what? Condition, hal, you see them, they are eclipsed. They are eclipsed. Munkasi fani and became munkasi fani. That is, hal is mazuf. That is what Dr. Sab wants to draw our attention to it. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That's it. So, is, brothers and sisters, here it means and then, or only then, huh? Are you with me? Okay, brothers and sisters. Now, we come to number 14. Vasallu. What is the meaning of sallu here? What kind of a word is this? Fialu Amar. From where? Salla Yusalli. Salla Yusalli. Okay, brother. Sallu Amar. Antum. Wow is your file. Hatta Yanjaliya. Okay, brother. Yanjaliya. An Mudma. Hatta. After Hatta, there is an hidden. Okay. And that is why. Yanjaliya is mansub. Okay? Injala Yanjali. Fine, brother and sister. Yanjali means it becomes clear. So what is that it? Huh? Yanjali, file, damirun, mustatru. Takadiruhu, 
Hua. But where does that Hua go to? Where does it Hua go to? It's not mentioned. So what is that Hua? Al Kusufu. What is it? Al Kusufu. What is Al Kusufu? Eclipse. Until that eclipse goes away. Are you with me? It becomes clear. Got the idea? Fine, brother. Al Mafahum Minasiak. Minasiak. What is the meaning of this? Brother, this is understood from the context. Al Mafhumu means the understanding is from the context. Minasiak means context. Is it clear, brother and sister? That kusuf we understand from the context of the sentence. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Number 15. kulla kalimatin mimma yati fi jumlatin mufidatin. Now this is easy, brother. Make simple sentences. In fataha. In fataha al-baab. In kasara. You can say, waka al-zujaju ala al-ard. Fa, fa in kasara. Fa in kasara. Fine. In kalava. In kalava sayara. Ta kasara zujaju. Fine. Lao la. Brother and sister, we can write down. I want to write down. Lao la hayatu. Wa la danisti abaru. Wa la zurtu kabaraki. Kabaraki. Wa la habibu yuzaru. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Laula al hayahu la adanis tiabaru wa la zurtu kabaraki wa al habibu yudaru. But you can write anything you want. You can write down anything you want. You can say, Laula al islamu la dalal nasu. Laula al islamu la dalal nasu. Laula al ilmu. La jahil nasu the people would become illiterate. The, the people would have become illiterate. Okay. Anything you wish to write, brothers and sisters, inshallah. Uh, Alhamdulillah.